Unbelievable. RNG ticket and then RNG ticket some more. Freaking hell. <laughs> Murphy's Law at work here. Oh, different music. Oh, we got ourselves a behemoth! How many red chocobos though? How'd you get it? How'd you X comment? Well, looks like I have, uh, looks like RNG had a plan for me. Question here is, can that behemoth actually make it out of that island? Alright, chocobo, come close. What do I want to do here? I want uh, I want I want a lot of JP farming on Brant. So actually, we don't want a lot. He's got a master squire no matter what. Stab up and sudden cry. I got a shitty behemoth. But I guess he'll have to do 253. Wait, what? Only 253 HP. And his attack stat is, once again, I expected a much higher attack stat. What's up with that? Stab up, strikes enemy with horns. Vertical 2 effect 1. Okay, just a regular physical attack. Sudden cry. Attacks enemy with rushing thrust. Add dead. Interesting. So, this guy's got instant death. Range 1, vertical 0, so it has like no vertical tolerance. But we can use a behemoth to instant kill some people if we want. And he's beefy enough to get, what, 2 tones at least with our, before he dies? Speed of 7, so that's kind of respectable at level 24. My only problem is this horrible brave stat. But beggars can't be choosers. I'm gonna get, out, get myself a behemoth. Uh oh, does he not have items? Oh crap, I forgot to give him items. Address range 1, vertical 0, chance the same. Shite, <laughs> I see. Well, it is instant death, so it is expected to be shite. Can we cheer up? Let's hope we get that uh, red chocobo relatively early. Otherwise, he's gonna he's gonna completely spoil my data. Oh my god, that thing has decent movement. I don't want to get the behemoth first. Does invite have vertical tolerance? Vertical 3, okay, okay. So I think uh, we'll be able to talk to him from here. 34%? Okay. As high as I can get. Shit. It's gonna be on onto me next turn. What? Oh shit! That was 7.5 H. Well, hopefully I don't have anything to fear from the goblins. They are upgraded goblins, though. They're green goblins. 
Once I get the Chocobo, I'll just let him uh, wipe everybody out. Good boy. I thought I was going to run away. Ow! What? 120 damage? Shit. Behemoth is faster than us. Thankfully, that guy does not have any range attacks. Do we have good compatibility? 45% invitation! Hell yeah! God damn it. What, seriously? Forty-five percent over here too? Still didn't get him. Yeah, that's just bad luck. Don't think the goblins can do anything. Because uh, I've, I'm standing on the beach. And they're pathetic in water. Come on, somebody get him. Oh my god. I don't even have items this map. So if the Chocobo is going after her, I better increase her brave, even though she's got over 70. So much for goblins not being able to do anything. Come on, I should have already had the red chocobo. This is just extremely bad luck. 45% chances. Probability theory is just getting laughed at over here. Come on, get him! What? Unbelievable. What the hell is going on? Here comes the behemoth and he's going up to- oh god they're gangbanging her. 44 damage really? That's because of his uh, crappy brave I guess. He jumped on top of the beam? How the hell does that work? You can jump on top of people?
How much is the behemoth? Okay. Finally! Man, that, that took an age. Oh, got the behemoth first, right? <laughs> Goblins wouldn't know what hit him. So most of the danger in this mission should be mitigated now. Very lucky that all of those auto potions are uh, activating. Alright, check them all. Go and kill them all. I should check out this. Uh Chocobo stats, if it's better than the ones I've got. Brave 73 Brave! Oh hell yeah! Uh, Fate 68. Magic is 21. I, I think it's good enough. What exactly is the behemoth planning to do? Okay, this is depth one. Uh, do I want to go on depth one though? Wait, we have a vertical tolerance of three, right? So we should be okay with this. Suddenly, all the Wololos are working. What well, addition appeared to the game from Monster Skill? Is that like always the case? Monsters uh, always get one extra ability with monster skill. Shouldn't Ramsa have monster skill? No, he's got defense up. Alright, he's just fresh off of uh, chapter 3.
shit. That is uh, depth too. Oh, got him. Alright. So we got ourselves a shiny new behemoth with horrible stats. But I'm mostly interested in his uh, instant death. 12,000 bucks. How much? How many? Uh... So 12,000 bucks means even if I wasted like 20, around 20 X potions, we are still recovering that money back. Let's find out. I'll get rid of the black chocobos first. Kick off here for Behemoth, Hurricane for King Behemoth, and I'm guess for Dark Behemoth. I see. Giga Flare! Giga Flare! Is that, is that a magic based? Maybe I can get rid of one of my red chocobos. Yeah, I know exactly who to get rid of. This one. Wait, what? Holy shit, he's level 27. There is one under level red chocobo. Where is he? 22, 25. Really? At level 25, he has a magic of 20. And this guy's at level 22, he has a magic of 21. What the hell? You know what? I won't get rid of my uh, red chocobos yet. We do have four disposable units. Monster version of the fair that wizard uses. Uh, didn't we see Dark Flare already? I mean, uh, Giga Flare in uh, the the things that come with Velius, they they use Giga Flare, don't they? It does about a hundred damage. That's okay, I guess. So they got us also Behemoth. First things first, save.